what's going on guys today we'll be looking at some crazy hacking that happened last season in clash rail that got the top one finish stolen so i don't know if you would necessarily call it hacking but a lot of players sort of exploited certain things and got better finishes that they weren't supposed to get because of that so Basically, there's this player that I'm going to show a game of in the background whose name is Akaza. He's a French Electro Giant player. And for the final game of last season, he faced a Brazilian guy, Pedro. And Pedro ended up beating him. But basically what the guy did, the French guy, he decided to attempt this glitch. And yeah, I don't know if you would necessarily call it hacking, but it's kind of disrupting the service of the game. So... I feel like you can consider it hacking or something similar. Maybe not quite hacking, but you guys get the point. So basically what he did is he tried this glitch where if you lose a game at the end of the season, if you instantly close out the game before you click the OK button after you lose, then the trophies you lost aren't lost. You retain all the trophies that you originally had before you played the battle. And he definitely knew what he was doing. It's very hard to accidentally do something like that, especially at the end of the season. The players are always on their accounts at pretty much all times. So basically he did that and he finished top one when he should have finished top two and Pedro should have finished top one. So yeah, it was a pretty big issue. People were really mad about it, but then something was revealed. And we figured out that Pedro also did the same thing. So it's really just a huge messy situation. I'll probably show you guys some tweets on screen at some point during this video. So yeah, we figured out that Pedro also did it. But he didn't do it on his main account that he could have or he should have got number one with. But he did it on his second account. His second account finished top six. And it should have not even finished in the top ten. So I was actually affected myself by this because I finished top ten this season. But I should have finished top nine if it weren't for his glitch abusing so yeah it's pretty pretty messy right now hopefully supercell is able to do something and fix this glitch because it's been in the game for over a year at this point i think but supercell just is refusing to fix it i really do hope supercell fixes this for the competitive integrity of the game i heard about seven people in the top 1000 did this glitch and it affected over 100 players rankings anyways let me know what you think in the comment section thank you guys for watching and see you in the next one bye